there creative community, this is Karaksu coming to you with another video. And I am right now on the Sun Fury server. Well, the server that is not open yet for you guys, muhaha. And uh, what we will be doing today is making an off-axis ship, like not making it straight that way or straight that way, but like somewhere down there. Uh, this will give the spawn, because it will be in the spawn, uh, a new kind of twist that makes it all come alive. It's very hard though, as you will see. And our model we will be looking at is this ship. We will not be making this ship off axis, but we will be looking at it for inspiration and our general shape and form, etc. Like with the junk sails. I really, really like junk sails, so I am very happy that Clint, who made this uh, boat, used junk sails as well, as I, like, proposed. So anyway, to build a off-axis ship, you first want to establish, like, the off-axis-ness-ish thingy. And in this case, I think I will go, um, like, this. What you want to do is... Um, make a line that is as straight as possible in Minecraft, like whilst not following the grid. If I don't make any sense, then just open up Paint and look at what um, the line tool can do. And just like draw a line, I believe it is a bit. Just draw a line, see how the pixels are, and replicate that in Minecraft. Um, of course, the more complicated your line is the more complicated the build will be but also the better it could turn out notice the good like if you can't build correctly then it doesn't look good um, so for the size I want to go bigger than that ship but not too big because it still needs to fit into the spawn uh, which it, that that's the spawn right there, but you only see the outside like the rough thing and nothing from the actual spawn and I am not going to show you either because the server isn't up and until Jana the leader of the team decides we will um we will <clears throat> until Jana decides that we will release it, I can't show you guys anything of that slash time set zero normally fj would film this with me but he's not really a video commentary guy so well you can't really force anyone into this and that would be very bad anyway so no problem so yeah then what i'm doing now is trying to make the ribs the angles however you want to call this um and that is like the the start where you can can go wrong or right. This is not very easy, not at all. Um, you will always have to like go up above and see how it goes. Like these two lines should be parallel with each other, and I think they are, but I might be wrong, which we can still. Wait, probably if I change this block to here, I think that's already a bit better. Like, if you go above, you can cl clearly see the line going that way and that way. But we need to try to make it like it would be parallel with each other and like in an angle of 90 degrees if it were quote unquote reality. And that's not really easy with enough axis built like this. Then again, now that we have this line here, we can easily replicate that line here. And then you still have the same lines, which can't be anything but parallel to each other. <laughs> so yeah, it has been a while since I really posted much how to build videos, but I think this one is not really something that has been done a lot like i haven't really searched too hard for it but i haven't found anything either so now we have this we have a little bit of an idea of course we still need to do the back um, but now we have the general idea of how our ship would well work uh, how our ship would look um, this looks really weird but then again it could be right 
it's a it's something uh, this is really intricate you have to invest quite some time before it's really anything good but the hardest parts are the parts where it's different from the rest I think maybe like this no this one still has to move one block it's still not completely correct but then again that ship ends uh, not on not in a point but in a like circleish shape 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 yeah so how do we go about making the complete um thing well of course you have the upper like ribs i think i i think they call them ribs but i could be very wrong so don't hold me to that um is it bigger than that one though not a lot so i am going to make it still a little bit bigger just because i can i am kiraksu i like building big so then we build big come on damn lag <laughs> hate you go die in a corner on your own nobody likes you dum, 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 dum. and then you see eventually when I finish this which could still take a while wait. yeah this might be a little bit boring but I am not going to cut stuff out how did I ah oh. Kura, you are stupid. Why must you be stupid? Then it should be like this. Yes. So now it is at least big enough. Uh, I find this to be big enough anyway. So then we just need to do the end again. But let's wait with that shall we so then we have the upper ribs as I like to call them here. Um, there is the leader right there. So then we have the upper ribs, which are not bad. Um, I will now just go ahead with the side. Like, when you look at it, it has the, ni the nice boat-like curve. And that you need to replicate here. Luckily for us, we have one positive thing. And that is that we have this middle line here. This middle line will be our guide. It will be very easy. Well, quote-unquote, very easy. To make a ship look ship-like with this kind of help because now we can do this we just stay on the same line as this middle one whilst we make a curve like shape that makes a boat boat shaped I guess uh, I don't know how you would otherwise pronounce it uh, but if we do this then we are guaranteed to make it consistent with the top and when you make a build consistent you are good in building like you need to make your builds consistent <sighs> I'm sorry if I don't make a lot of sense people I haven't done this in a while and I do not know why I have this very weird accent right now which is from no real country and if it is I might be offending people which is not my purpose in life no it's not I'm not a rage face. <clears throat> that sounds a little bit like a scooter. Uh, so yeah, I went a little bit too flat with that. So I need to make it a little bit more curved. And really, starting this build is really a lot of adapting, redoing, readapting, and so on and so forth. And actually, that is the same thing with most other builds like uh, you can build something fast which is not bad um, but if you can make something great that takes a little bit of time then that's even better of course because you need to take your time every now and then and lately I have been sort of rushing my builds uh, for like uh, for example for rage which is not really what we want. You see what I mean? This delivers us a little bit of a boat shape. Might uh, go back and change it a little bit even still. But not a lot. It really looks like that one. 
but a little bit bigger, so that's exactly what we wanted. Uh, of course, the deck will have multiple levels as well, now it's still flat. Now comes a challenge. We want to make this go ahead and make it curved up to this block. Um, that gives us the actual ribs. Now I'm fairly sure that these are called the ribs, that what we are going to make now. Um, the problem is making them, because in Minecraft you are limited to, well, completely the grid of Minecraft, which is fairly obvious if you didn't know that, then really, have you ever, re ever even really opened Minecraft? <sighs> talking a lot, talking a lot. Yeah, like, I need to keep talking because I do not want to disentertain you guys. You need to have some commentary, really. Now, now I'm starting to do the voices again. Please stop, Kyraxo, please stop. So then we have this, as close as two ribs as you can get in Minecraft, I think. Uh, maybe someone else can do it better than me. I am still fairly new to this, um, but I believe I do it quite well since I made another ship that I might show at the end of the video, I don't think I will do. Um, that was my first ship and everyone on the build team said it was good even though I thought otherwise. Uh, maybe this is a little bit better, yeah let's go with this. And then of course since this one has the same level or altitude, uh, we can just copy that rip. And yes, I do have, we do have world edit on this server, but really I can't be bothered to like go and specifically select those spots. I went wrong somewhere, didn't I? One, that's, oh, uh, okay, I see where I went wrong. Uh, the orientation of the logs doesn't really matter at this point in time, because we will be going back with world edit and changing them, so the logs will be apparent like having their bark on all sides. If you don't what I'm if you do not know what I mean, it will become very apparent at the end of the video. Yes indeed. Now I seem to have made another mistake yet again. Kira, why are you doing this? Or haven't I? Yes I have. Everything is just <sighs> Kiraxu. Get your stuff together. You need to, to build very good if you want to please your audience. Yes, you do. Stop making these damn noises, Kyraxo. It's not you. That's rage. So yeah, then you have a new kind of rip. Because this is like one up. You need to redo your entire form as well. Uh, you want it to look alike. Not the same, of course, because you are working with different shapes. Um, and... Therefore, in real life, you would also have different shape um, ribs. But then again, they need to be uniform with the rest. So yeah, that's the hard part of building. I think I will move this here. It might be better, it might not be... You see, this is a very, very difficult thing to do in Minecraft. Obviously, since it is off-axis and you have, like, blocks going everywhere, um, and if you do not know what I am building, then it gets a little bit confusing. I mean, if you see this, you might guess what it is. Well, at least I hope so, because that's what I hope to do here. But if you do not know that, then it can be, like, what the hell is this chaotic formation of random stuff doing here? No idea. So yeah, you want to convey the shape. If that makes any sense to you. I hope it does. So then we have the ribs. Yes, we do. I think it's good enough. So after you did the ribs... um. There comes another hard part, and that hard part is making uh, this, these spots, the, the rings of the, the hull, like the upper part, I think. I don't know ship names, uh, the, the, the parts of the ship. <laughs> I better, um, study what they are called. 
Um, and seeing as I have been going on for 15 minutes already, I think this video would be split up. Um, seeing as I'm a very, very lazy person regarding my editing, uh, maybe. Then again, I have only Windows Live Movie Maker and everything, like free programs. So I can't really do that much. But it shouldn't really be an excuse to not do a lot. Uh, I think this is how it would go. It, no, no, it can't be because now this is this is a point where you have to pay attention. Yes, these lines are parallel, and that could be well. Obviously, it will be arced here, but these two lines are straight and they are parallel. All good and fine, isn't it? No, it's not all good and fine because this side is smaller than this side. Uh, for the eye, that is. Of course, you're still working in Minecraft, as I have said like a dozen times over. But you need to make it as good as possible. Now you see they are, quote-unquote, equally sized. Well, then again, they are completely the same shape now. But that is what you need to do. This will get even harder when we get to the arched parts. Because you can't... You, you, it's just impossible... To mirror these because they are off axis time set zero I wish I had command block axis then I could set it to permanent light but no but it really matters but still dum -dum 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 -dum. so yeah I will um, show you guys what the build team can do once we have some stuff going out um, then again it's all up to Janikin what we do or do not release. And since I have been working on some projects that have been in my mind for some time here, it could take some time before they will get out. Like, the build team is very cautious with uh, publishing stuff, which is very understandable. I mean, it's really easy to just have someone rip off your idea um, like you should know if you have watched Minecraft map extravaganza lately there are a lot of copycats out there who just claim others builds as theirs and when you are working with a build team and investing a lot of time and a lot of effort into something that is the last thing you want to happen to you so yeah this would be an arced back um, of course you can't mirror this, as I said, because if you mirror this, then you just get something with a... Well, let's call this a rip for now. That ends like mid-air here, which is absolutely not the shape that you not want. Not? What? So, yeah. Then you have the arc here, which is a challenge because it needs to be the same-ish whilst well not while well, just it needs to follow the quote unquote grid and that can be hard now let's take a look from above and actually that does look like it is round at the back which we wanted like i said at the beginning of the video or videos hello creepers hello why are you not on fire Oh yeah, because you're standing underneath my thingy. Yeah, why not? Just just chill down there. <sighs> then here we wanted to get a little bit pointy inwards, which here we have to draw a straight line, I think. But a straight line does not look good here, especially since everything is not straight lined. You have to put a little bit of an arc in here still. So, yep. And then this side is more like this, I guess. Am I right? Am I wrong? I am sort of right, but I don't think it is exactly what we want yet. Is this maybe more? I think it's better. Of course, there would be a peak like here in this form. More like that. 
So then we only need these two bits still and then we have the general shape of the hull down. Um, and we do not want to delete this yet. The middle line is our big big help in this build. And deleting it is one of the worst things you can do. Well then I can maybe not exact. Well I'll get back on that. But if you are making something like a ship uh, off axis and well a ship is a structure so you still have uh, that going down if you're making like a dragon then this might not be the tutorial for you but yeah oh let's just go ahead and look from above if the shapes are equal no they're not no they are not this one is too flat that one is a little bit more arced so then it's our job as builders to go back and make it a little bit more arced. Is this better? A bit, but not yet. That level that we want. Like this. I think this is it. Might look a little bit too arced now. Yeah, definitely a little bit too. So let's go one step back. I think this looked the best. Then again, it's not even. Let's just edit this side a little bit then, because this this is the hard part in building this. It's not really something you do like it's nothing. So yes, now we have this. Then I will show you guys how the actual uh, editing of this these logs go goes I can't talk English don't mind me I'm Kiraxel D slash slash expand 5 just to be sure I mean I know I was on top but yeah. then what you could do is slash slash replace 17 which is the ID for the logs 17 13 what this does you see it makes uh, the log appear like it has bark on all sides this is a very very useful trick that you might that you may want to use in the future this is also how they make the giant world trees look like they have bark everywhere like otherwise you would have what we had before like slash slash undo like pieces sticking out everywhere which was the old minecraft and not that there is anything wrong with that per se i mean the block is perfect as it is but for this purpose we want to do this like the, it's not like you change the texture it's like just texture on all sides minecraft has this with some blocks not with all blocks that it can do this <clears throat> So yeah, now we have this down. I think I will end this video here and will come back to you with another video uh, regarding the rest of this. Maybe make three-part even because we are on 25 minutes almost, well, 23.30. And I guess I will just see you guys in the next video. So yeah, bye-bye. See you then.